Hey guys, welcome into my channel. On tonight's stream, we did a playthrough of the closed demo of The Cecil The Journey Begins. Um, Genie Interactive Games was generous enough to give me my own personal copy of the closed demo as well as two keys to do a giveaway, which we were able to do tonight. I'm so excited for Felicity and Dweet who get to experience the demo as well. But I just wanted to go ahead and also post this here on my YouTube channel as well so y'all could experience it. It is super fun. I am so excited for this game to come out in full. I can't wait to play it and I hope you all enjoy this little bit of a playthrough of the demo. Okay, let's go! I'm so excited. How did we end up in this hellish place? Sarah and I were just looking for a weekend getaway, a break from the stress of our daily lives. We found this hotel online, and it seemed like a decent place. A bit old-fashioned, but charming in its own way. We never expected it to be like this. After we checked in, we went up to our room. Everything seemed fine at first. We unpacked, talked about what we wanted to do during our stay, but, but then... But then... We heard strange noises coming from the hallway. It sounded like someone or something was out there. I went to check it out, leaving Sarah in the room. And Don't leave that's her in the room. That's when it all went wrong. Don't leave her in the room. It's a trap. The next thing I knew, I woke up in this cell. I have no idea how I got here or how long I've been trapped. And Sarah, she's missing. I don't know where she is, but I have to find her. Click, use, interact, fire is right or left click. Okay. with these cuffs. consistency of rubber cup on a long handle used to clear block pipes by means of rubber pressure. Okay, we're gonna take that. Okay, um sorry. I wanna use this one. Do I does that mean I can use it now that I have it? No. I don't know how to do things. How do I select this one? I want to use it. Did it say how to... I need to unclog this toilet, but I think if I go back, it's gonna... Yeah. Well, how do I select my plunger?
Am I dumb? I think I'm dumb. If I close out, it goes right back to me not holding my plunger. Okay, use. Okay, 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 okay. Woo! We got it. Okay. The rusty chisel is durable and rugged is a durable and rugged tool designed for chipping away at hard surfaces. This chisel is made with a wooden handle for a comfortable grip and a rusted metal head for maximum strength. The rust on the metal gives it a vintage look and it gives the chisel a certain character. Okay. Is there anything else in the toilet? No? Okay. Can I use this? Yeah! Rusty chisel doesn't work. Okay. Hmm. What can I use the chisel on? Um, is there a keybinds option? Um, I don't know. No. sound the constant drip of water echoing through the halls. The walls are made of stone and the door is thick and heavy, locked with a key that's just always out of reach. But I will not give up hope. I will not let this cell be my tomb. I have nothing but time and I will use it to my advantage. I will craft a tool, a weapon to aid in my escape. With nothing but a small piece of metal and my own determination, I begin to fashion a crude tool. Day after day, I work tirelessly, honing and shaping it until it becomes sharp and strong. I will use this tool to pick the lock, to break the chains that bind me. But as the days pass, I cannot shake the feeling of being watched. I can hear whispers in the darkness, a sinister laughter that seems to come from the very walls themselves. I fear that I am not alone in the cell, that there is something far more sinister lurking in the shadows. But I will not let fear defeat me. I will use this tool and escape this prison, no matter what horrors I may face. I will not rest until I am free. Oh. The weird tool is a versatile and unique tool that features a sharp pointed tip for precision cutting and piercing. Its unique design allows it to easily open and access small tight spaces such as holes and bolts that may be rigged or difficult to access with traditional tools. This will do the trick. I bet I could pick this little lock. Yes, let's go lock pick. Okay. Nothing over here of value? Okay. Well, okay, where do I go? find a way out. Okay. Well, a couple of times a year, our Miss Brooks, the Duke of English at Madison High School, is obliged to invite her principal and his wife over for dinner. On these occasions, the fact that she's extremely fond of Mrs. Conklin and feels rather differently about her principal... Strange. That is a strange shape. Yeah. How to sprinkle ground glass in the food without okay. getting them both. <laughs> This postcard was completed, but never sent. Okay. Much to my surprise, Mrs. Conklin came over as I was finishing breakfast that morning. Ten people, all missing from this hotel. What happened to them? An old weather newspaper from from a tragic era features a somber headline reading victims of the Cecil. Okay, let's see. Let's let's read about these victims because that could help us. 
Emily Thompson disappeared after checking into a secluded hotel deep in the woods. Michael James found dead in his hotel room with a strange symbol carved into the wall. Ashley Rodriguez murdered in her hotel room by an unseen entity with no signs of forced entry. Jessica Brown vanished from her hotel room with only bloodstains left behind. Brian Walker died in a mysterious fire that broke out in his hotel room. Samantha Davis suffocated in her sleep with no explanation for how the attacker entered the locked room. David Adams attacked by a monster that appeared from the shadows in his hotel room. Lauren Baker strangled to death by an unknown assailant in her hotel room with the door still locked from the inside. Brian Clark found dead in the hotel basement with no explanation for his death. Katie Lee dragged out of her hotel room by a mysterious force never to be seen again. Okay, we're taking that with us. That's that that feels important. Can I not open can I oh, I can't jimmy that open with anything? Okay. Let's do some more investigating anything behind this wall. Okay, let's, uh, oh, that's fucking creepy. Dude, why are your eyes missing? Okay. It's unusual, but this might prove useful later on. A very special thing to collect. This may come in handy. Well, it sounds fine, but there might be one possible catch. What's that, Miss Brown? He might enjoy being over the barrel so much he might never get him off. I know a lot of things are missing eyes. I'm like that thing. Like I feel like they're trying to tell me something. Doctor Gene Zimmers. I wonder if he's behind all of this. I mean, it would make. I can't take it. I want to steal his ID. Let me steal his ID. Harry, your mother doesn't know the meaning of the word work. Apparently, all she knows is how to ask for things. Oh, but Daddy still... No sooner does she learn I'm making $300 extra by going on the next show. There's something behind that. She wants the first goal. Now, if you'll excuse me, Harry. Okay. Anyone, I'd rather I think we've explored everything in this room, I guess. Um, oh, okay. Another room. Okay, time. Come in, Miss Brooks. Time will only tell. Good morning, Mr. Thompson. Only time will tell. Only time will tell. But there's some kind of meaning behind that. That looks like a paintbrush for only. Moon and stars for time. Sun for will. Looks like a sunset for tell. Okay. Oh. Why did I turn around? Wait, does that fit in that other thing? No, no. That looked like that weird shape that was in that thing in there, kind of. I don't know, maybe I'm wrong. What is this injection, though? I don't like the sound of that. <gasps> should I go investigate that, or should I just keep looking in this nice, safe little room? Look at these two, this thing real quick. Why you got a voodoo doll? Oh, jeez. Oh, gosh, I guess I gotta get a look in here. Wait, I can use the... What? Well, oh, okay, it doesn't. Okay, I need something else. 
Do I not have any other inventory items other than the... Okay. I think those other things that I used to get all that sell were like one-time use thingies. Um, okay, so I have to find something else to get out of here. Oh, 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 this. Oh. Oh. A wooden paintbrush is a tool used in art and crafting, specifically for applying paint to surface. The handle of the brush is made from sturdy, smooth wood, which provides a comfortable grip for the user. The bristles of the brush are made from natural fibers, such as horsehair or boar bristle, which are carefully arranged to create a tapered tip that holds paint and distributes. Wait a second, wait a second, paintbrush. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. There is a paintbrush for only. Is there something that has like a moon or sun or I feel like this has something. I don't know. Uh, I wanted to see the condition these cages are in. The only way I can persuade them... Oh, wait a minute, wait a minute, paintbrush. Oh, well, today is the wrong day for that. You said that to me twice before today, uh, about two other things. <laughs> it almost seems as if you don't want me to see it. Oh, now, Mr. Okay. Why shouldn't I want you to see it? Well, I don't know why. What just opened? Was it the door? No? I wonder what it is. Oh, well, I'll probably find out about it when I see Something it. opened, but I didn't Tonight? see what it was. Oh, I, I knew there was something to tell you, Mr. Barney. The dinner for tonight has been canceled. And Mrs. Davis is very ill. Oh, Y'all heard something pop open. Oh, 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 oh. Come on quite suddenly. Oh, what is it, Sue? No, let me let me touch it. Which one is it? Take your pick. The mercy key is a unique type of key, and you try the door with this. Yes. Now, it's time to find Sarah. Oh god, that's so creepy looking. It's for the lobby. You got it. Why is this in the middle of the floor? Hello? Is anybody in here? safe getaway if it was me but not just me
this the door? This is the door I came out of. Where does this door go? It's locked. Um, okay, and I don't have the key anymore. There is a key in there, though, so... If I can get in there, there's a key of some sort. Um, that's locked. Los Angeles Cecil Hotel, a popular priced hotel of destination. card for room 203. We'll take that. I will definitely take that. This store is really different from the others. That's going to have something to do with something. I can almost guarantee it. like her. She creepy as fuck. Okay, I need to get what how do I get what you're holding? I need it. Give it. I don't think that this will work, but you know what? We'll just try it. Nope, it doesn't work. I was like, I don't know what this thing is gonna be for, so how do I get that from her? There's going to be some kind of puzzle to do with these two urns, the one over there and over here, and then these two heads. And I'm wondering if they have to do with um, getting that from her. I don't know what to do. Register is missing one key. Okay. Um. It's an old map that is tattered and worn as if it's been through countless showings before. The parchment damaged with age, showing 12 doors in a circular formation. As I examine the map more closely, I notice that certain doors have a strange question mark on them, almost as if they hold some sort of secret or hidden meaning. Anything on the back? Okay. no longer safe here. The lobby wants a refuge of warmth and welcome. Now hosts an eerie silence that chills the bone. Shadows seem to move of their own accord and the whispers, they're not just in my head, are they? In fear for our guests and ourselves, I've taken it upon myself to secure the key that unlocks the hallways, or hallway to the rooms. I can't risk it falling into the wrong hands. I've hidden it well, stowed away where only the most observant eyes will find it. But I beg you, if you find this note, tread carefully. There is something terribly wrong in this place. As it, it's as if the hotel itself is watching, waiting. Okay. I need 
need to search every vase. Okay, I think there was, is there another one over here? This gleaming golden key attached to a key ring grants you access to the hotel room's area. Okay. Would that be like the east wing and west wing, I wonder? Room area key. Okay, so that's not a room area. How do I get to the room area? Do one of these. Not 100% sure where the room area is. Oh wait, I should look at that map. I'm dumb. Okay, so, okay, it looks like the little U-shaped thing is this, okay. This should be room areas, right? Okay, yeah, that is super creepy. Um, any of this stuff? Investigatable? No. Okay, let's keep going. Welcome <gasps> on Pipe. How do I close the door? I need to close the door! I need to close the door! Me a heck of, oh my god, okay. Um, I should, I should reopen that door, right? to open that please I'd like to open it please I want I need I want the axe please
Notice, hotel renovation alert, limited accessibility in some areas, third floor. Okay. The way I just like keep like chickening out because I'm like, oh god, I'm scared. Well, actually, I should probably go this way, but I don't know. Oh, uh, I don't think I can open it. That's fine. Wait, I need it. 202. Is this 202? No, next one down is 203. That's the one I have the key for. Wide is shut. Okay. here. Okay. Locked. Oh, okay. An old prescription bottle for pain. I wonder how often this was used. What's this? Room 103. Discovered a torn page from a ritual book with mysterious symbols. Room 202. Found a locked drawer with a cryptic code etched on its surface. Room 301. Uncovered a hidden compartment containing a partially burnt map and found a crowbar and a guest bag. Room 402, I found a bloodstained note hinting at a hidden passage. I didn't touch it. Yuck. Room 501, discovered question mark? I can't say. I took the crowbar I found in the guest bag in room 301 to the supply room for safety purposes. I think we're going to need to find um, that storage supply room. First safe voice message. Hey there, it's me. I hope you're holding up okay. Listen, I've got something important to tell you. I, I stumbled upon a clue that might just be our ticket out of this nightmare. You know that painting, The Last Supper? Well, it turns out it holds a secret, but you'll need to shed some light on it. Make sure the light faces the painting and go reveal a hidden path. Uh, follow that path, and who knows, it might just lead us to freedom. But Here's the thing, Olivia. Dr. Zimmer's lurking around. Always watching, always scheming. Keep your guard up, stay sharp, eh, and don't let him catch you. We're in this together, and we'll get through it. I believe in you. Stay safe, my friend. End of messages. Memory updated. Um, the clue is concealed within the Last Supper painting in the ballroom, which, when illuminated, is said to uncover a hidden secret. This may serve as our key to freedom. However, Olivia's whereabouts are currently unknown, and something quite peculiar is unfolding, but where is the ballroom? Was there anything on that little map? It's probably in either the east or west wing. weird so that's that's weird that's that's suspicious okay um oh there's this little thing here over here maybe there's something on here no okay um why is it open to crack there's gonna be something in here oh it's jammed okay <sighs> <laughs> We shall see, John. We shall see. Um. Um. I knew it wasn't gonna be. I'm like, I'm still wondering what that robot collectible's gonna do. I'm like, where can I set it? Um, I don't feel like it's safe to go out there. I'm gonna be real. I'm gonna be real. I don't think it's safe.
Jesus Christ, please protect me. I'm so unnerved right now. I'm so scared. Also, welcome in, Insidey. How are you doing this evening? I, I don't know. What do y'all think? Am I, do you think I should leave while he was jingling his keys out there, Mr. Jingles? Or should I, I don't think there's anything in here to get in here. I don't have anything in my inventory. I mean, I, I don't think that, I don't think that my little robot dude, yeah, no, that's not going to let me in. I'm a little scared to open this door, I'm not gonna lie. I feel a little trapped in here. I'm doing good. I just woke up. I slept all I slept all day too. Dude, I I felt so bad. I had like the worst like fever and I was just like feeling not good at all. So I slept most of the day. Feeling better now that I got some sleep and like ate some good food for dinner, but it was rough. Hopefully you got some good sleeps and stuff. I don't know what to do. Uh, I guess we're, we're, we're just gonna fucking do it. We're gonna fucking do it. I'm such a chicken. I'm like, terrified to like turn corn I don't uh... okay. why are you turned around backwards I've got to get in this bathroom. I feel like the bathroom is the next step I need to get into. But how do I get in here when the door is jammed? Maybe I need to go back and find the storage supply room. Because what they say in that one note? No, I picked that note up. Oh, yeah, crowbar, crowbar. We need the crowbar to get the jammed door open, right? That would make sense, right? Like, I feel like that's a thing. Okay, guest in 301 just sort of Okay, we don't know where the storage supply room is, though. That's not mentioned on this. Actually, wait, I think the supply room was in that main lobby. Um, oh, 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 oh. Hello. You can use this to gain access to the safety box. Which I believe was this way. Oh, I'm walking out here just small. I'm like, guns blaze, let's go, motherfucker. Firebox? No. Listen, I feel a little safer having this axe. I'm not gonna lie. Well, should I go back and try to, like, axe my way into the bathroom? Or do you think the crowbar is what's gonna be needed for that? Because... We're, we're, we're almost here. We'll just run back and try to hit it with the axe. Axe don't work. Okay. We've got to go back to the storage room. But we have an axe now. 
I feel like that's an important thing to have. I feel like just like the utmost sense of unease. Like that jump scare did me a heck and frighten. Is this the storage room? Maintenance? Not me trying to hit down everything with my axe. We need to find that crowbar, but how do I get to the storage supply room? Like, even the notes, like, a oh, storage supply room? I'm like, where is it? Um. How's Cecil so far? Welcome in, Felicity. It is really good. Like, I have been sufficiently jump scared. I'm, like, in a state of unease right now. I'm afraid to, like, even move. But it's really good. How are you doing? Discovered a torn page. I, I gotta find the storage supply room. Where it at? I'm about to just start whacking at everything with this fucking axe, y'all. Like, I'm not even, I'm not even joking. No, can't use the axe on that? Okay. Um, I, these are still gotta do something. Like, they have to do something. Like, let me in. Let me in. And I don't, we don't know where the ballroom is either. I can use this to break down things in my, wait a minute, wait a minute. I think I know what this is for. I think I know what it's for. I'm kind of scared to go back this way. I'm like, what if I go back in and that, that thing's there again? I hear like I don't, maybe it's just my ears. I thought I heard like some running water coming from one of the rooms. No, this isn't the room. This isn't where I thought the axe was gonna work, but I figured I'd try it just for shits and gigs. What'd that thing say? Guest bag in room 301. Maybe we need to go to 301. I don't, maybe that'll. mean stand still storage area Check-in list. It's a really strange set of items. Yes, 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 yes. What kind of said? Anybody that would like a chance to get a closed demo key for the Cecil, make sure to type in exclamation point giveaway in chat. Um, 
we can extend the first one a little bit. But yeah, it, yes, 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 yes. It's so much fun so far. Like, uh, it's so unnerving. Like, ugh. Let's see. Weird object. Just dots. Okay, okay, okay. Crowbar. Note from Sweet 608. Bullets from 501. Lockbox found at front desk. Device missing four parts. What's about? Okay, so it's a it is a horror game, and basically this guy and his significant other um, went to this like hotel for a little getaway. Well, he left her in the room for a little bit, and then the next thing you know, he wakes up in a cell. She's gone, no idea missing where she is, and now he's trapped in this hotel trying to find his way out. And it is very creepy. Okay, I need to, okay, head back to Olivia's room. Okay, I need to get in there, but okay. Yeah, I don't know if it's based off of the actual Cecil Hotel, but the name, like, I immediately thought of, like, the, the Cecil Hotel. I think this one takes place in a different hotel, but under the same name. Okay, there's gonna be some good shit in there, but I can't get in there yet. I'm really scared to open this door because there was, like, the weird noises. Okay, we gotta go back to Olivia's room. He said, I got, I'm not going to run. I'm not going to run. Literally, though, I was, I got jump scared so hard earlier that, like, my heart was, like, jumping for, like, 10 minutes afterwards. Like, it, it scared me so bad. Okay, is this Olivia's? Next one. Next one is Olivia's room. Okay. Shut that behind me. Okay, uh, crowbar. Oh, I don't, oh yeah, I forgot. The items are like one and done you, so I don't have my, I don't have my safety axe anymore. Ugh. Ugh. I need my safety axe. Oh, there's that other fit part of the, oh no. They've done a really, really great job of this game just having an overall just really creepy vibe. Like, this looks like a really fancy hotel that is absolutely not safe anymore. Um, that wasn't there. Why are you playing music? Wait, wait. This, this is a different room. Dear Diary, I don't even know where to begin. The last few months have been so dark. Like I'm stuck at the bottom of a pit. And every time I try climbing out, I just sink lower. I feel like a shadow of myself. I miss James so much. Being apart from him physically hurts. I lie awake at night, playing our last moments together before he shipped off. I'm terrified each day may be the one I get news he's gone forever. This war has ruined us. Working at the hotel is unbearable now. The manager is a bully who threatens to fire me if I say anything about the bizarre stuff happening around here lately. The guests are so rude and demanding, too. I hate every minute wandering these halls now. It's like the life has been sucked out of this place. And get this. There's some creepy guy in glasses who keeps popping up wherever I'm working. He just stares and lurks in the corners. It's the most unnerving thing. I don't know what he wants, but he's bad news. I can just feel it. Whew. 
Wait, wait, wait. He's constantly in the lobby, sitting on the couch by the ballroom next to the picture of the young... That's where the ballroom is! We know where the ballroom is now, y'all! Room ser Literally, room service visited. Room service delivered. Okay, so that's... I, I had said that that picture was fucking creepy. That's where the ballroom is. Okay. I think there's... Time stuff. capsule. Strange clock. It seems like it's from an unknown era. This may be... Yep, we're gonna take that. We're gonna take that. We're gonna put that away. Um... Oh, 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 oh. Room area maps. Okay, okay. Take that. I knew it. I knew it. Oh. Pew pew, Hanny. She locked and loaded. Uh. Here we got here. These dog tags must have been close to Olivia's heart, a memento of a faraway war. 98 since the game's army service. Wait, but how is this Olivia? How is this Olivia? Because if we go back to the other room, there was a cell phone there with a message for Olivia. But this is like very clearly not why the music stop. Why did the music stop and why did it autosave? Yeah, I have a feeling I'd be playing this with my eyes closed. It's so creepy. I'm so, I'm afraid to open the door. I'm afraid to open the door. Like something bad's gonna something bad's gonna happen. The oh, ballroom no. seems to be a place of interest. I'd better head there now. Why'd I whip out my Glock? Why'd I whip out my Glock? Find the ball. Why'd I whip out my Glock? Is this all in my head? I don't think so. The Cecil Hotel has a reputation for darkness, John. Who the fuck are you? Good luck. <laughs> Holy shit. Trying to shoot my gun. The ballroom seems to be a pl Okay, so, okay. I ha I ah! Why wasn't it let it maybe just run? Maybe. I don't know. But there was no way out of the room. <sighs> Oh god, and my health is already down to 40 because I fell through the fucking floor. Is this all in my head? Maybe you get, maybe if you get hit, you can make The Cecil Hotel has a reputation yeah. for darkness, It's got John. a reputation for darkness. Who I got fuck a fucking you? gun. Good luck. <laughs> Like my new creation, John. No, don't touch me. Don't touch me. Oh wait, can I run through here? Can I just go? Can I just go? Oh no, I can't go. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> I 
Have I ever mentioned that I'm really bad at shooting on mouse and keyboard? <laughs> I can't shoot with a mouse and run with a keyboard at the same time. It's like I can't walk and chew gum at the same time. The ballroom seems to be a place of interest. I'd better head there now. I got I got a couple shots in this time around. Is this all in my head? The Cecil Hotel has a reputation for darkness, John. Who the fuck are you? Good luck. <laughs> I got back up like a Holy shit. shit. How do you like my new creation, John? You're so fast, my man. Did I get it? Did I do it? Oh my god, slay pop off of the hell of go, girl boss queen! Yes! Okay, this is just what I need to get out of here, but where do I go to get out of here? Okay, I need to use that health potion because who knows what else I'm going to find. It didn't fully heal me, but it got me back up to 80, so that's good. Yay, Felicity! Congrats, you won the first giveaway of the evening! Do I need to get back to the main? Head to the lobby, okay. Wee woo! Well, how- I need to get back to the lobby. How do I- how, how do I get back to the lobby? Oh. What are those? Maybe there was something I was missing in here. No, because that's where I came from. We do not want to go back in there. We do not stand that room. Okay, that oh, okay that I, that was easier than I thought. Oh shit. <laughs> this is getting very creepy. <laughs> oh shit.
John arrived with Sarah at the ominously looming Cecil Hotel, eager to explore its dark secrets and disturbing history. After settling into their dimly lit room, Sarah vanished without a trace, prompting John to frantically search every inch of the sinister hotel. He soon realized that Cecil was gripped by a malevolent presence. The twisted Dr. Zimmers and his evil experiments on innocent souls. As John navigated the narrow halls and adorned with unsettling portraits, he uncovered the tragic fates of those who came before him. In the rooms of the greenhouse giver, Olivia Cro I can't read fast enough. My bad. I am so fucking excited for the full version. Oh my god. It was so good. And there you have it. We completed the playthrough of the closed demo for the Cecil. Um, shit started getting crazy at the end. And I now am impatiently waiting for the full game because I had so much fun with it. So many jump scares and honestly just a like unnerving sense of dread throughout the entire game. But I had a lot of fun with it. It's like the perfect game for Halloween season. And I am so excited to find out more information on when the full release is coming out. So I hope you all enjoyed um, watching the playthrough as much as I enjoyed playing through it myself. And um, see you all next time. Have a good evening.